Make on me balling, stop that, stop that, get now. Stop that, get now. That is my thing, baby. Stop that, stop that, get now. Stop that, get now. Street football and nothing else. Play that game, me no coja for problem. Street football and nothing else. You can go take it in my stack, boy, me progress. Looking at the soccer ball at my feet All our parents are teachers A word that will keep on running the streets Seems to me and it's plain to see We may not be rich or anything No one's complaining As long as we can play our game As long as we can play our game I have a surprise for you Something you can look forward to that'll make your last few days of school more bearable. A surprise? Yep. A week-long trip to Asia during vacation. What do you say? All right. Great. That's yeah. awesome. awesome. Betty, are you serious? So cool. I worked out all the details with Miss Adelaide. You'll be attending the trials for the upcoming World Cup for the Asian continent. No, no way! Well, the teams are looking forward to your visit. Well, that's all for now, Blues. That's some surprise. Incredible. <gasps> awesome. Uh, do you realize how lucky we are? Yeah, no kidding. The reason I want to go is to brush up on my kung fu moves. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, oh. Yeah. Hoo. Yeah. Yoo-hoo. <laughs> ah, yeah. He yeah. Ah, that hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Even Jackie Chan's not perfect. And now, please welcome the Street Soccer World Cup champions, the Blues, Eloise, Samira, Gabriel, Jeremy, and Tag! The teams competing to qualify for the next World Championship are the Calcutta Cobras, the Mekong Pearls, the Dragons of Shanghai, Remember them? Our old opponents? Hey, guys! And the Saigon Serpents. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Yeah. That was pretty awesome. Wow. They could teach you a thing or two about Kung Fu. I don't need their help, thank you. A little practice and I'll be a kung fu master. Yeah, right. I'd like to see that. <laughs> Jeremy, you don't know the first thing about kung fu. You want to bet? Sure, you're on. Give me a week. I'll show you. What's up, huh? champs? Good to see you again. You won't be disappointed you came. The final phase of the Asian trials is going to be very exciting. I bet. Those serpents are pretty impressive. If you ask me, they won't be easy to beat. We won't be easy to beat either. We'll stop at nothing to participate in the second Street Soccer World Cup. We gotta go. We have practice. Okay, guys. Catch you later. Hey, come on. Let's go over and meet the serpents. Mm -hmm. That's Bang. Next to him is Chung. Sitting behind me, Swan. Lan over here is our goalie, and I'm Ken. It's a great honor for us to meet the Blues, the world champions. Same here, guys. We are thankful to have the opportunity to play against the best teams in Asia, but we have little hope of making it to the World Cup. You're joking, right? You could win the Asian trials easily. Maybe, but... Anyway, for the time being, we're just thankful to have this great opportunity. Hello! Uh, that's Kim, my little brother. This is for you on behalf of the serpent. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. You shouldn't have. Wow, I've never seen a ball like this. It's beautiful. It was made especially for you. What do you say we grab a bite to eat together? Our treat. You choose the dishes. Yo, sounds good. I'm crazy about Asian food. Try this one. It's not uh, as spicy. It's uh, sticky rice with durians. It's milder, and it calms uh, the burning sensation. Oh, thanks, but no thanks. So what's your life like in Maryport? Do you get to play soccer all day? We wish. We spend most of our time in school. Gabe, Tag, and I all go to the same boarding school. And, um, whoa. Uh, no chance I can find a fork here, huh? We all wish we could study. I dream of becoming a huh? doctor, but it's impossible. It's hopeless. Not for me. Kian is trying to teach me how Wait, to read at night. you mean... None of you go to school? Well, no. Here, poor families can't afford to send their children to school. But we're good at other things, like soccer. And Kung Fu. Master Huin is teaching us. Master Huin, huh? Is he any good? He's a master. He teaches us in our spare time. It's not far, at the old Temple of Dragons. Whoa, I didn't realize how late it was. We have to get going. 
Please excuse us, and thank you for the meal. Too bad. Looks like there's still tons of food left to eat. We're sorry, but, um, we have a... We have an appointment. And they'll get in big trouble if they're late. Shut your big Ooh. mouth, Kim. Don't worry. We're still on for the friendly game tomorrow, right? Yeah. We'll be there. See you tomorrow. I wonder why they left so suddenly. Their appointment sure didn't sound like fun. Who knows? Maybe their families are really strict or something. Uh, listen, uh -huh. um, I gotta go as well. I plan to spend the afternoon at, um, at the Xiaobang Museum. I won't bother asking you to come along unless you're interested in 12th century Asian art. Later. <laughs> this is where Master Huin lives, right? Tell him I'm here for the Kung Fu lessons. Oh, and tell him it's extremely urgent. Hmm. Before entering a sacred ancient temple, your spirit and mind must be calm and serene. Yeah, yeah. I'm in a hurry. Can you just call your master? The master is right here, in front of you. Very funny. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but no one would ever believe you were a Kung Fu master. You have neither the look nor the build for it. <laughs> Uh, I'm so sorry, Master. Being an apprentice is difficult, young man. It requires discipline, willpower, and obedience. You're not yet ready, young man. Patience is virtue that is only lesson I will give you. Come back tomorrow, when you have thought it over. But I'm ready now. I may not have patience, but I have willpower. I'm begging you, please let me start right away. I did... No. Tomorrow. Late. Maybe they're not coming. It's strange. They seem like they really wanted to play. Here they come. <laughs> the serpents made it. What happened, guys? Nothing. I'll explain later. Please uh... accept our apologies. It's all right. Come on, let's kick <laughs> on. <laughs> are up one nil. <laughs> we have to make our passes fast and sharp. Those good-for-nothing stole it. And they have 10 seconds to come with me or they're in serious trouble. No one's going anywhere. What do you want from them? I don't know. I think we should call the police. Mm -hmm. Please don't. It's all our fault. We never should have accepted to play today. Come on, get moving. Who is that guy? He treats them like dogs. Or prisoners. He doesn't like them, that's for sure. He can't get away with it. Let's follow him and see where he's taking you. Yeah. Um, all five of us don't have to go, do we? Let me guess. You're going to the museum. By the end of the trip, he should be an art expert. Let's go. Uh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Don't lose sight of them.
There you are. I was just uh, warming up while I waited for you. I'm ready to begin the exercises, Master. Before exercise can begin, the apprentice must learn a few fundamental principles. Principle number one, the apprentice must learn the virtues of humility and simplicity. If you wish to become my apprentice, you must remove noise from ears and take off that frivolous clothing. You will wear this from now on. What? No way, forget it. I'll look like a fool. I won't, it's ridiculous. And principle number two, <clears throat> respect hey. and obedience. Apprentice obeys master without question. Now go sweep the courtyard. It will teach you humility. Come on, Blues, keep it up. We can't lose them. All done. Clean enough. I finished sweeping the courtyard, Master. I'm ready for Kung Fu now. No. There is no I in Kung Fu. Principle number three. Apprentice must learn to be selfless. But I... Yes, Master. Good. Now you must peel those potatoes uh... for tonight's meal. Uh-huh. <laughs> Principle number four. Huh? Apprentice is tireless and perseverant. Here are some more potatoes. Huh? Maybe it's a special soccer boarding school. There's only one way to find out. Wow, I didn't know I could cook. I think I'll have me some. Yum. Mm. It was selfless yeah. and generous of you to prepare this meal for the homies. You deserve a reward. Huh? It is your turn to eat now, which brings me to principle number five. Apprentice is satisfied with little. But, but, but... That's what the serpents didn't want us to know. They work! You're going to work overtime, or I'll turn you into the police for stealing that bomb. We just wanted to give it as a gift. Enough! Get to work! That guy's a real slave driver. Talk about exploitation. Let's do something about it. Hold on, Tag. We might get them into more trouble, you understand? Don't worry. We're gonna talk to the person in charge of this soccer ball factory. Underneath a shell of impertinence and arrogance, my young apprentice conceals a pure heart. Follow me. Where? I'm going to initiate you to the ancient techniques that have forged the most illustrious fighters. Daily chores are an excellent way to learn the art and technique of Kung Fu. Come see me when you have mastered this exercise. But they're just children. They should be in school. If they're forced to work at such a young age, they have no hope of doing something more meaningful with their lives. You're destroying their future, sir. <laughs> you don't understand, do you? These children are lucky. Other children would love to be in their situation. Thanks to this job, they can help their families. But they're too young to work. You're exploiting them. Do you think begging on the street is better? Listen to me. You're Westerners. You don't understand. You have no idea how privileged you are. Oh, God of soccer, if you exist, if you're out there somewhere, help me in this moment of need. Yeah. You see, huh? even simplest household chores, however unrewarding, can provide excellent training. This has taught you balance and control. Dexterity and endurance. You are now ready to learn techniques of combat. That will be all for today. We can't just abandon the serpents to their fate. We have to find a solution. Oh, hey, Jeremy. Did you get your dose of culture at the museum? Well, I see you're suffering from intellectual overload. Hmm. You haven't forgotten the kung fu demonstration you promised us, right? That's all I think about. Goodness. He sure is wiped out. I wonder what he's been doing all day. Blues, you wouldn't happen to know where the serpents are, would you? Their game's about to begin. No, we don't. And we were wondering the same thing. 
Yeah, we're a bit worried. Well, they have five minutes. If they don't show up, they're eliminated from the championship. Please don't fit, eh? They're late, but maybe it's not their fault. The World Cup is extremely important to them. I'm sure there's a good reason. Couldn't you reschedule the game? Sure. That means tomorrow they'll have three games back to back. But if they don't show up tomorrow, they're disqualified. Yeah, okay. They'll be there. Blues, blues! The serpents are in big trouble. The boss is really angry. He locked them up in the factory. He says they're punished and that they have to work more. He locked them up just because they gave us a ball? Mm -hmm. We have to help them. won't budge. It's heavy. That's it. There, there we go. go. Tag. Tag, you found us. We knew you'd come. We knew it. Let's go. Come on. The coast is clear. Hey, you... Uh, take your hands off me. Let me go. Let me Oh, you creep! Huh? Uh, Take your filthy uh, hands off her, you uh, brute! Oh, yeah! Yeah, yeah. Come huh? here, fight like a man! told you I was a kung fu expert. Now do you believe Our me? Our very own Jackie Chan. You really yeah. blew me away. Uh, uh. <laughs> I was nothing. When Fede told me you guys went looking for the serpents, I figured you'd go to the factory, hey, so I... Hey, what on earth is going on here? Well, huh? it's quite simple. Your foreman locked all these children up and forced them to work overtime, all because they gave us one of your exceptional soccer balls. Is this true, foreman? I had no choice, sir. All they ever think about is the world cup. What you did is shameful. You don't have the right to mistreat children under your supervision. You're huh? fired. What? As for you children, you'd better get back to work now. This world cup business is giving you false hopes, you understand? This factory is your only future. Not necessarily. Come watch them play tomorrow, and you'll understand. Please, come to the game. You won't be well, wasting your time. All right. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> it's just not right for the serpents to work at their age. I know. In this part of the world, child labor's a serious problem, I'm afraid. It's so unfair. Even if they qualify, they won't be able to come to the World Cup. Stinks. If we don't do anything to help the serpents, they'll be manufacturing balls for the rest of their lives. Wait a minute. I might have a solution. I'll organize a benefit game. The Blues against the Serpents. A friendly match. Welcome, sir. You won't be disappointed you came. Tag, this is Mr. Tan. He's a journalist. I asked him to cover the game for the newspaper. <laughs> a journalist? A little publicity for the serpents can't do them any harm. I guess you're right. Do that! Woohoo! Yeah! One more! Go, 
Its efforts come on. Huh? <laughs> Serpents are up two one. Ah! Two all. Yeah. Three two to the serpents. Three all. <laughs> Time's up, game over. You guys are amazing. You're gonna go a long way. And you were incredible. This is going to make headlines. <laughs> They'll have no problem getting sponsors. Uh -huh. Excuse me, they already have one. Oh. You can write in your paper that oh. Mock Chalk, the soccer ball manufacturing company, is sponsoring them. Got it? Well done, children. I'm very impressed with what I saw. Starting today, you will never set foot in the factory again. I have decided to finance your education and your athletic training. Uh, uh, it is a dream come true. The serpents are deeply grateful to you, sir. And in exchange, I hope you will provide excellent publicity for our soccer ball. We will. You can count on us, sir. Welcome to the Asian Street Soccer World Cup Trials. The two teams competing in this first match are the Shanghai Dragons and the Saigon Serpents. Ah! Final score, the Serpents win 2-1. Ah! Ah! The Mekong Pearls are eliminated 3-1. The Serpents defeat the Calcutta Cobras 1-0. The winning team of the Asian Trials, qualified for the World Cup, is the Saigon Serpents. Serpents! We're qualified! Serpents, World Cup, here we come! Serpents! Serpents! Yay! Thank you. We can never repay you for what you've done for us. Thanks to you, we can continue to play soccer. But most of all, we're getting an education. In any case, you have a bright future ahead of you. I'm sure we'll be seeing you again in the World Cup. I hope. But if we want to beat you, we'll have to work hard. Especially if you become kung fu experts like Jeremy. <laughs> yeah, well, kung fu comes naturally to me. Uh, sadly, modesty does not. Brilliant match. Your teams are as powerful and as fast as the dragon. And my stubborn apprentice has made much progress in little time. Who would have guessed you could learn kung fu in a museum? Make me bali sata sata get now, sata get now. That is my thing, baby. Sata sata get now, sata get now. Street football and nothing else. Play that game, me no coach or no problem. Street football and nothing else. You can go take it in my stack, boy, me grow. Looking at the soccer ball at my feet All our parents